Good morning, good afternoon and good evening. So today I got Redmi 9, code name Lancelot. Request was coming to flash the latest release of the hyper operating system having Android 14 on the Redmi 9 code name Lancelot. So today the video is about how to flash the latest release of the hyper operating system. This is a ported ROM. This is not official release. For the ported ROM to flash on the mobile phone, we need to unlock the bootloader. And the bootloader will remain be unlocked as far as you are using a customized or a ported ROM. So if you don't know how to unlock the bootloader, then must watch that tutorial video. Link provided in my video description. Unlock the bootloader first, then you can follow the further steps. So things that are working and not working, list provided in my video description. So if you if your mobile phone is having an unlock bootloader, then you can simply follow the further steps. Must charge the mobile phone battery to maximum so the mobile phone can get the ROM easily. Save all the internal storage data. Every flashing of a customized ROM will erase everything. So must save your internal storage data. And in case if your mobile phone is uh, having lower MIUI version, then you need to uh, flash the custom recovery according to the Android version. For example, my mobile phone is updated to the latest MIUI 13 Android version 12. So I'm going to flash the Android 12 custom uh, supported recovery first. Then I will flash the Android 11 because this Hyper OS will boot and will work on the the MIUI 12.5.6 premiere, which is having Android version 11. Using password security, must turn off the screen lock. Then in case using me account, sync your me account once, must remove it. Sing, go to your account sync, sync your Google account once and then must remove it just to avoid any issue later on. Simply power off the mobile phone. So here is my downloaded folder and I have downloaded all the files. So I have provided the links in my video description. Just make a new folder and download these files. Now my mobile phone is having uh, MIUI 13. So I will definitely first go for the TWRP support Android 12. And then later on, after flashing the firmware file of 12.5.6, then I will install the Orange Fox recovery support Android 11 because the Android 12 recovery will not support and will not work on the Android version 11. If you try to flash this uh, recovery Android 12 on Android 11 firmware, the mobile phone will get a boot loop. In case if your mobile phone is having any customized ROM, which requires to flash the firmware file of 12.5.6, then you must be having a custom recovery install, which supports Android 11. So in case if your mobile phone having any custom recovery of the Android 11, then simply copy the Orange Fox recovery, this one provided in my video description. Simply copy it from the downloaded folder, paste it into the internal storage, boot the mobile phone into custom recovery, which is already installed. Install or flash this custom recovery with the help of that recovery, which is on your mobile phone. Then reboot the mobile phone into orange box recovery. Then do the wipe things and copy the hyper OS ROM file into the internal storage of the mobile phone and flash the update hyper OS ROM with the help of this provided orange box recovery format data and done then reboot the system in my case I will flash first the the custom recovery support and white 12 first of all I will extract the custom recovery uh, in same folder and uh, then uh, uh, open the, opening the extracted folder of the custom recovery. So the mobile phone must be power off. We need to boot the mobile phone into fast boot mode and the mobile phone must have an unlock bootloader. So the data cable service is required here. Check the other side of the cable must be connected with the computer. Then uh, press and hold the volume down key and connect the cable with the mobile phone. In few seconds, the mobile phone will boot into fast boot and release the volume down key immediately. So we got the fast boot screen. I have released the volume down key. Coming back towards the computer screen, as I mentioned that 
my mobile phone having MIUI 13. So I will flash the Android 12 MIUI 13 recovery first. I will, I will double click the flash one batch file. The recovery flashing will get started. The window will get auto close after flashing. Then double click the flash two file and then double click the flash three file immediately. Press and hold the volume up key before me logo appears. Just wait, let the set boot into custom recovery. We got the recovery immediately release the volume up key. We'll go back to my downloaded folder. So we got the uh, storages uh, on my computer screen. We we'll double click the internal storage and uh, definitely the storage is got encrypted. So come to the mobile phone screen. First of all, tap the wipe system partition, then tap format data, type YES over here, then tap here. Done. Go back to main screen, tap reboot and tap recovery. And again, the internal storage appears. I will double click the internal storage. Definitely the TWRP is only the folder that will be that can seen on the internal storage. We'll go back to my downloaded folder and uh, we'll copy the firmware file 12.5.6 12 12 and the Orange Fox recovery support and write 11. Copy these two files from the downloaded folder. We'll go back to my internal storage of the mobile phone. We'll paste both files on the internal storage. So both files copied. Now coming back towards the mobile phone screen. First of all, tap wipe system partition, then tap advanced wipe, select the first partition, Delvic art, data, cache, system. That's all. So, uh, swipe to start formatting, turn and go back to main screen. Then tap install firmware or patches, select the firmware file, FW lens slot, tap on it and swipe done go back then uh, install the orange fox recovery tap on it and swipe the mobile phone will auto reboot when we'll start booting into orange fox recovery swipe here now i can see both files on the internal storage with a proper name like orange fox and the firmware file which means that the storage is decrypted and we can copy paste we'll go we'll come back to my computer screen and this time i will copy the updated update hyper os android 14 rom from the downloaded folder we'll go back to my internal storage of the mobile phone and i will paste that rom file on the internal storage of the mobile phone so we got the file copied on the storage so we are done from the computer Disconnect the cable from the mobile phone first. Then tap the second, uh, third menu. And uh, select the Delvic Art Cache, Data Cache. That's all. Swipe. Done. Go back. Tap the first menu. And select the Update Hyper OS ROM file. Tap on it and then swipe to start flashing. Finally, the flashing completed. We'll go back to main screen, then we'll tap the third menu and we'll tap format data, type YES, tap here. Turn, then tap reboot system. So the first boot completed without the setup screen and this Thing already mentioned by the developer that there an internal problem with your device this is nothing just I'm okay and this thing will come every time after rebooting the mobile phone so we got the hyper OS version hyper OS version is 1.0.2 global version ported version we got the basement version over here kernel version showing unavailable
so the camera application is the stock miui camera and uh, the pre install application coming with the rom is the magis this rom is pre-rooted so well uh, i will check the rom later and this was the tutorial how to flash the hyper os android 14 rom on the redmi 9 thank you so much take care we'll see you next time goodbye